But why and how? How is it that we achieve this intense feeling of thrill doing all of these crazy things? Let's find out. Well, it all starts in this place in your brain called the amygdala, which is basically where all your emotions are generated. Of course, not all of us have the same capacity for scare. Ah! So why are some of us thrill seekers and others not? Well, people with thinner sections of gray matter in the brain tend to perceive the stimulus as less dangerous, and therefore, those people are the ones that have become thrill seekers. And that's not what I mean. Anyways, that doesn't quite fully explain the phenomenon of thrill. Dude, you're next. There are a few things that occur when the brain is encountered with a threat. First, the amygdala releases a combination of chemicals that includes adrenaline, dopamine, and endorphins. Dopamine has many functions in the brain, including telling the brain that there is a potential reward if the threat is conquered. As the response intensifies, the brain sends testosterone streaming into the body. This boosts strength, giving the person a better chance at success. Because adrenaline also shoots into the body, it increases heart rate. With the heart beating faster, the brain and muscles get more oxygen. The body reroutes this oxygen to the brain as fast as it can. And because of the flow of all of these chemicals, we achieve this feeling of thrill. And that is also why some of us keep going at it. Now you might know why you or your friend might love thrills. If you liked that video, subscribe, smash that like button, and comment down below any questions you might have or anything you'd like to see on the NICEI YouTube channel. That being said, see you guys next time.